Hi everyone, this is a quick tutorial of content drips, uh, the new interface which we have launched. So now we have some scratch templates as well. Uh, you have square, portrait, landscape, and also the carousel templates. And code photos will be available uh, in a week or two. So now we are logged in. Uh, so in the my design, all the design which you created or edited will be there. So you can easily edit them or come back at. So now you can also give your templates some names as well. So let's go with this template. So I already worked on this template and it's almost done. So something new uh, in this interface is now it's all full page canvas and you can also move around it by using your two finger gestures on your trackpad or if you are on your uh, keyboard or mouse you can hold space and then you can uh, move around the canvas so also you can do this via this button as well if you click on this button and it will move the canvas and if you click it again it will go back to normal so uh, what else is new now you can uh, use the auto branding feature like if you click on it it will update the profile and the details from your active profile you can also change between the profile as well like if i change to this profile and click on auto brand it will update everything with my new profile which is pretty cool uh, okay so next thing is how you can add the text simply just click on the text and you can drag it down and it will go there or you can also click on it as well and it will place the text there and to upload the pictures click on the upload icon uh, it will show you the last uploads click on it and it should be there uh, we will be adding the drag and drop function to this as well uh, to the images as well so you can easily add wherever you want to <coughs> okay now you have some brand logos as well if you have uploaded the brand logos in your brand assets you can uh, use them on your templates easily it's like this uh, like if i show you my brand assets You can see these are brand logos which I've uploaded and the colors and the fonts. So, okay, what else? Uh, now you can add signature as well if you have already uploaded. I think I haven't uploaded mine or I think I have, but it's really small. So, yeah, you can upload signature as well in your profile. Uh, elements is something new. Uh, you can search for shapes, let's say stars and it will show me the elements of the stars like this and also i can change the colors if i want to which is really good you can like get more creative with it uh, you can rename this to anything else let's say um, neon colors you click on the save and it will save the template for you so to down download the image click on the export you can download pdf pngs as normal let's download pngs and it will uh, download the png files for me here you go so yeah that's it if you want to go back to the templates you can go back easily so you can come at it as well and it will load the template for you so let's go to the profile uh, in the profile you can add your avatar name handle website url signature also you can create multiple profiles as well now which is if you are handling some more brands you can easily like use it to your advantage so yeah uh, this is it uh, what else i can show you uh, maybe let's show you the uh, simple templates like square so let's say if i want to make any post for my instagram or linkedin i can just easily add the text and arrange it also you have option to copy to image as well which will copy the image to your clipboard and i will copy it and if i go to twitter i can easily post this uh, which i don't need to download so it's really fast uh, similarly you have one editor for all your pictures photos carousels and that's my favorite part which is changing the profile and auto branding which will upload it the new profile for me so yeah that's it if you got any feedback or comments let me know 